everybody welcome to my channel today we're gonna to talk about teens dating and because I have uh, things that I really want to say and I don't want this video to uh, be a, a very very long one I just decided to uh, break this theme in two or three parts and uh, uh, this way it's better for me to explain all the things that I want to say and for you to not get bored with uh, um, such a long video. So I'm Rita and today it's all about you. First of all, dating in teenager times, it really assures the development of the uh, gender identity. The dating experience for a teen helps them to uh, find and learn about their own um, physical and their own um, emotional way, which means that uh, um, this helps to um, understand their own bodies, but also understand their own emotions and these new emotions that uh, um, intimate relationships create. So this is an opportunity for a teenager to explore new feelings and to explore um, new ways of uh, using their own body. Teenagers will start to understand their own roles um, in an intimate relationship. So this new experience will uh, really give a very uh, important uh, role in uh, the teenager developed as a, a partner and has a, a person in an intimate relationship. And this he will carry for the rest of his life. This is important because this is the moment that the way he will start to deal with these issues, it's the way that he will take it for the rest of their lives. Of course, everybody can adjust and change a little things, but the beginning is always the most important and the first experience are really important for um, teenagers' time. This is the first expression of uh, uh, autonomy that teenagers will have from their own parents. So experiencing um, dating and, experience, and experiencing having uh, uh, intimate or romantic relationship will uh, start to detach um, the teenager from their own parents and this is uh, a value lesson and a value experience because little by little he, the teenager will learn to be much more independent and learn to be much more um, have much more autonomy and uh, uh, not having this codependence that usually a child have from his parents. And of course, establish a social uh, status is another thing that um, is giving to a teenager when he starts to dating. This um, probably it's not so value for parents and for outsiders, but it's value for the teenager himself. So it's important because he will start to have uh, different connections in uh, their social lives and they start to have uh, a different status. So when teenagers start dating, they uh, are not searching for a long-term relationship as young adults. They usually focus on the partner as a reflection of their own self, as an extension of their own self. And this is why usually these first experiences are totally different and feel totally different than the other ones that usually a person has during the life. These romantic relationships, they usually contribute for 
self-understanding and the identity formation. And this is um, something that uh, it's uh, um, validate uh, during teen, teen times uh, because this is the time that uh, usually the teen is uh, still searching for their own identity and this experience is one of them that help teenagers to really uh, find and uh, understand their own identity and their own purpose and even sometimes um, help them to create some different goals for their own lives. Knowing how to establish a healthy um, ro romantic relationship helps teens to grow up, contributes for their health development and can eventually be a good uh, a way of develop even the uh, social skills because in this time they will learn about themselves and about others and healthy romantic uh, connections they can even help establish positiveness in other areas such as school authority group works and have a nice relationship with the parents, with the authority and with the, um, the future adulthood. But falling in love is really difficult to manage and the weight is not just emotional but also physical. And this, is, this happens because teenagers are still discovering their own bodies, the center of pleasure and the whole dynamic of body and pleasure and uh, everything that uh, um, it's sex related. The executive function of the brain is one of the, the last parts of the brain that is developed and this is why the maturity in teenagers is not so visible. Have poor judgment and reward sensitive actions bring by the immediately feeling good experiences. And some of the examples can be related to sex and can be related to the uh, using of uh, uh, drugs or other um, addi addictive uh, substances. But this also affects other kind of uh, areas and other kind of skills in uh, teenagers. And this is why it's kind of common that teenagers feel a little bit lost about for instance, what they want to do in life, in the future, what kind of career to seek, what kind of relationships to have. And actually, this even leads um, a certain amount of young adults to the psychologist practice nowadays. But in the end, this is just a delay in the development of certain areas of the brain. So sooner or later these areas will be developed and uh, um, they will be able to um, find their own way and their own happiness in their lives. Dating establish an emotional autonomy of the teen from their parents and uh, this um, part of uh, teenager times it's such um, it has such an importance as any other one. So being teenager it's not easy and uh, um, the dating process it's uh, a little bit complex and uh, brings a lot of uh, uh, new experiences for teenagers. The important thing is that all these psychological facts about these teenager times um, having this uh, dating experience and this uh, romantic and sexual experience, they are uh, a part of teenager development and this will uh, be an enrichment for their own um, self, for their own emotions and for their own um, mental uh, state. And this is important to understand that uh, um, a healthy uh, teenager will uh, always will want to have a relationship and uh, 
we as parents we have to understand that this is normal and that uh, this is not just a physical need but also an emotional way of uh, um, developed as a person so that's all for today guys i hope you like it i hope you subscribe to the channel leave a thumbs up share with a friend comment if you want and and next time I'll be giving some tips uh, for parents and for teenagers about dating. See you then. Bye.